Previously on Alan Wake. It's not a lake. It's an ocean. After saving my wife from the mysterious dark presence, I wonder if I it'll cover the DLC. Trapped in the dark place. Imagination can be the enemy here. A nightmarish world that exists somewhere beyond the shores of our own existence. We're the one making all this happen. Just do what Zane tells you. Follow the signal. Is all this really coming out of my head? The dark place is playing tricks on you. I made my way across its ever shifting landscape, trying to reach Thomas Zane. You're trapped in your own nightmares. You're still going deeper. <clears throat> Hello? Okay, the final DLC for the game. There you go, Alan. Was that Barry? It's all in your head. <laughs> You've been making what it the up. fuck? <laughs> Your delusions are out of control. Oh, yes, how you do? Seriously, Al, you need to get a grip. You know reality's different here. See what I mean, Al? 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 Ugh, I think I'm stuck on this side. Well, you're gonna have to find your way out of there. I'll wait. Just remember, you're still in the dark place. You know that, right? I don't want to alarm you, pal, but it's sink or swim time. Why doesn't Fine. he just like imagine his wife or something? Why does he have I to can have feel Barry? The pressure mounting. Barry was right. Time was running out. Everything I saw was a dark, twisted version of reality based on my memories and thoughts. Ooh. Oh, it's the paintings. What is this? Oh, whoa. Oh, this is cool. We have to make it crumble with the light over here. Maybe? Or wait, how the fuck? Oh, I had to swing it! Fun! Okay. That's cool. Oh, well, I walked straight up to the locked gate. I had to accept it. If all of this was from my mind, then I was the one making all this happen. I was literally fighting myself. It was a moment of clarity. They could have they could have put a little bit of a, a gap in between that dialogue cut. But that's alright. I'll be taking that, thank you. Surprise! Uh oh, oh, I don't know about this. <gasps> oh, worth it. <laughs> Recharge, reload. Thank you, Shaw. Oh, wait, did I do the ladder at the same time? What the hell is this? Oh, the ladder's on the outside. Okay, I see. I was extremely embarrassed by how long it took me to myself. figure that one out. All I had wanted was to save Alice. After that, a part of me had been ready to just give in and die. But I hadn't given up. Thomas Sane had reached me. I had run across a nightmarish landscape following a signal from him. He kept telling me I was sinking going too deep. I wasn't sure if he meant the dark place or insanity. Perhaps they were one and the same. Perhaps. I mean, this does seem like some level of insanity in his head if he's constantly here. He's probably unwell. Uh, Storm, are you talking about to have, like, the wrecking ball do that? Is that the part you're talking about? Oh, do I, lo I walk around here? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, skeleton. Oh, wait, no, 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 it's like the Vecna painting. Oh, Jesus. Chala, very nice. Considering you're a lesbian. Ooh, 
Okay, I don't have... Find a way back to Barry. We've literally been in this maze trying to find Barry. It's funny. Oh, well, here's our gun. Great. Hey! Nice job, Al! Shut up, Barry. So, you really are nuts, huh? Oh, it cut me Let's off? Oh, I wanted to go we the other way. always knew this was coming. Probably a dead end. I guess, but I actually feel pretty rational. Behind the lodge. That's Zane's light. Yeah, you're done sinking now. That means he's just about caught up with you. You better go talk to him. <sighs> Lots of fireworks here. Nice. We heard the old gods play. Music came out all wrong. It attracted the horrors. I do. Oh, okay. All right. All right. All right. Okay. Oh, the fires are fucking them up too. Please don't spawn behind me. Over here, that'll be good because then I can just trigger the fireworks off. The music screeched and boomed around the way as the monsters attacked. Oh my god, Casey, imagine. I wonder, I mean, I feel like. I, I feel like um, Lethal Company is reaching a large audience. Kind of similar to like Among Us in a way, because it's like that multiplayer chaotic type of game. So maybe it will, I don't know. Oh, sir, okay, you little scythe ass bitch. What a dodge. Hey, isn't it kind of ironic that you're a writer and you're threatened by your own imagination? It's like your greatest power turned against you. That's very deep, but I'm a little busy not dying over here. Jeez, always with the melodrama. Surrounded by the enemy and deafened by the noise. Wait, I'm out of batteries. Oh. Holy motherfucker, I'm inside there. Balls. Thanks. 
fucking house. Julia Buck, it's a reason. Dude, those projectiles were fucking mean and not a good way. What is hug? What is hug? Kate, <laughs> happy two months. Sorry. Woo! At least the song was singing. Now, Al. The big guy busted down the door. Whoa. See, Al? Of course, the staircase is blocked. You. Always making things complicated. This is just a memory. Even your memories are complicated. Uh, yeah. So, I guess you're gonna need to talk to Zane out there now that he's actually here. I'm just gonna, you know, let you non-imaginary people talk in peace. Thanks, Zane. Barry. You have done well, Alan. Now I can accompany you. You are trapped in your own dream. God? You must wake yourself up, but first, you have to reach yourself. The cabin? Yes, my cabin. It will not be easy. Your previous work can help you. I still have some pages of your manuscript left. Words like that have power here. Oh. Yes. Yeah, this is Zane. Thomas Zane. Boat, rock, rock, rock. The lighthouse? It's very appropriate. I can help you reach it. Cool. But after that, you will be on your own. I cannot enter the cabin now. The dark presence made sure of that on our last encounter. You are facing yourself, the parts of your mind. Why don't you just call her by her name? This is not a fight anyone else can win for you. Okay, that's different. Oh fuck, I'm out of batteries. Float. Oh. I was glad to have Zane with me in this place. This is cool. I knew the terrain such as it was, but a part as of this, me I mean, I've never played only up anymore after so many years in this place. Oh, I don't know. Uh, I've never played only up, but I've seen a little bit of it to understand what you're talking about. Yes. The world was tilted. It was turning upside down. Oh, are we gonna have to deal lost. with the fucking TVs fall. again? He couldn't tell which way was up. Oh. He would die here, torn apart by the whirlwind. <laughs> whoa! Oh, whoa! Cool. Oh, interesting. We don't want to go out yet. Oh, oh, everything. <laughs> oh, shit. Maybe we do need to jump out. Oh, oh mother. The wind was picking up. The wake was too hot. I was just waiting for us to get to like the bottom. At this height, the water would be like an incomparable. You can't want me dead this badly. Storm was coming. It would throw 
school bus. No! That school bus was so tempting. Sir. The storm spun him around. It was made of darkness. He'd seen what it could do. It swept everything away. I would have to make my way through this whirling madness. It reminded me of the dark presence. Just another memory. But it could still kill me. trust that one. What are you? That's better. Whee! This is cool so far. Dark breast and cacti. Who? about that oh what the ass shit oh, are you shitting out my ass We are in a law. It's to be expected. You're struggling to reclaim yourself. The landscape reflects that strain, but each step takes you closer. If you persevere, you can attain the lucidity that fends off the darkness. Nice. Okay, we're reloaded, baby. Now that I knew what I was facing, the environment became even wilder and stranger. Like it was no longer even bothering to pretend that things were normal. <laughs> I don't think it's bothering to pretend at all. <laughs> Mrs. Frizzle kind of bad. Lol. Oh, what the? There's a fucking horde of them. Please tell me this will work. Like, that's way too many to deal with. What the? What the? Front door. No, 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 no. Hey, just don't, don't. Let me through. Let me through. I swear to God, if someone hits me off this, I'm going to. Rage quit for the first time in my life. What the fuck? Someone just throw a machete at me? Oh shit, oh damn, oh shit, oh damn. I could probably just keep going. Oh, I'm in the light. All is well. Uh, this, yeah, this DLC call is called the writer. Hole? <laughs> what about the fireworks? Oh. <gasps> 
Bro, I just got 18 flares. That's not a good sign at all. Why? Hole. Do I need to drop a flare down there? Or do I fall to my death? Oh, I'm so smart. Does anybody know if I would have dropped down there if I would have died? Why do I feel like if I dropped down there, I would die? I'm not going to go down there. <sighs> Our brain is so intelligent right now. Parkour. Parkour. <laughs> Parkour. <laughs> what the fuck was that for? Guess what, everybody? I've got 50 billion flares. Quake was forced to run through a maze, hopelessly sprinting in the wheel, never getting it. Oh, I should have let that dialogue play. Oh, it's like a wheel. That's what he said. Oh, that's fun. Whoa. Oh my God, we're too quick. Wow, it's like a Ferris wheel of our life. Like, you know, the Ghibli song, Ferris Wheel of Life. That's that one, right? I hope I'm not mixing that up with a different one. Oh, sick. Merry-go-round of life. Shit, that is actually a different thing as well. Never mind. <laughs> oh, it's him diving in after his wife. Uh oh, y'all. Thank you, Alex. All right, we're swimming. This is fascinating. Mr. Wake, can I help you with anything? Let's have a look at your head, Mr. Wake. Please! God damn it, I said please! I need more light! This is so cool. It's like having the whole entire gameplay back, actually. This is interesting. Very neat. Like, the writers sat down one day and they're like, let's put the entire game on a Ferris wheel. Yeah, so far this feels less less fighting and more like puzzle exploring almost. Okay, well we don't want to fall out of that. Or maybe we do. Oh shit, I don't know. No, I don't think we go forward over there anymore. I think we go through here.
Oh, and this is the tube thing we went through with her. Barry and, and Sarah and uh, what's her face? I, keep want, I want to say Clarice, but that's not what it was. Cynthia. I don't know where Clarice came from. Cynthia. Oh, and our clicker in here, but it is not there. Elevator? Sure, why not? Very interesting. Next stop, Sandy. <laughs> Your name is Clarice now. You're doing so well. I... Keep going. That was cool. It's hard to make sense of this place. I've never seen Silent Hill. It's a dream. This is a vast place, home to forces and beings that are completely alien. The dark presence. Yes. I don't know what happened to it after your final encounter. Is there any way out of here? Sometimes transmissions can be sent between worlds. You've done this yourself. But to actually leave the dark place, I haven't found a way. Interesting. Why did I have to have a cutscene for our feet so I could load into like a new map or something? Stucky's gas station. <laughs> Not something I particularly wanted to see, but obviously I wasn't the one in the driver's seat. I forgot about Stucky. <laughs> Another memory made real. Blake would never make it. The insanity he was facing was already a part of it. In him. His own doing. This is where he we saw the, the big stuffers for the first time. <clears throat> thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ooh. Uh, I have 20 shots on my shotgun. I think I'll rather use that than have the hunting rifle. You may. I was actually right. What in the Fortnite? At least the lighthouse was much closer now. I would have to make my way up there somehow. <laughs> oh, great. Oh, you. Y'all are all codes. Why are you moving? Why are you moving? Stop that. about these things. Yo. Oh, I'm touching the, the owies. Do I have to just outlive them? What am I supposed to do? Oh, well, I mean, maybe I should use this new knowledge I have of having a GPS in the game and do that. Oh, fuck you. Oh, fuck you. Oh, fuck you. Shove something. Look at that. I didn't even have to fight him. Almost died to fall damage. Do I need to get all the wires or something? Okay, hold on really quick. Just in case I need to have these wires first. Fucking tastic. There was no power to the log lift. Oh, I have fucking a billion flash grenades. Or not flash grenades. Flares. Like a bunch of them.
huge. Cool. We're almost at quote 2222. Two, two, two. Nice. What's that sound? I should be safe. Hey! Okay, we're reloaded. Reloaded and recoded. Okay, we're supposed to follow this right. We're following the way, we're following the way, we're following the way, we're following the GPS I have. The part of you that is in control is in the cabin, dreaming and insane. I don't think I like that. You represent the part of Alan Wake that is capable of rational thought and planning, which is why I'm talking to you. If that part can regain control, then you have a chance of making it. But a part of you wants to give in. There's comfort in the oblivion of dreams. You represent the part that isn't ready to quit and die. Wait, are you telling me I'm not <laughs> real? It's okay. You're as real as anything else in this place. Oh. So there are two of me? Yes. And the one you called Mr. Scratch, he's me as well? No. Mm. Zane, are you playing some kind of game with me? I am not the author of your story. How can you say that when you wrote that page about me and the clicker? It wasn't one of my pages. You directed me to it. You had Weaver guard it. Yes, she was needed. And you needed the clicker. But I, I am not. What? I don't understand. Oh, Alan, you should keep going. Zane? Zane, come on! Well, that cleared things up. Interesting. Checking my ass. I don't trust anything in this game anymore. Nice. We are going quite high. We need some milk. <laughs> Sorry, Lee. Don't choke, please. The bridge rumbled, rumbled in the unnatural wind. It was heralding the enemy's arrival. Wait, what oh, flashbangs. Oh, fantastic. Okay, great. Yes. Let's... Let's use flashbangs, yes. I mean, I already have my pump. Is this if I accidentally took the... Does this give me extra ammo, actually? I have 28. 32. Ooh. Crumble. Crumble. Oh, shit. Gotta be more, right? Holy mama. Oh. 
Mother of God. That was almost too close. Nice. We survived. A moment. I can help you here. Sure. Oh, go away. Hi, Yogi. You, you fucking Jedi. It's like learning to control your dreams. There's a connection. You were in my dream. Yes. I taught you. You fixed the foolish mistake I made with Barbara. I've got the high ground, Anakin. It's over, Anakin. I have the high ground. I need to do another watch through the Star Wars films. <clears throat> Oop. It's been a minute. Ride Storm? I've had those dreams too. It's awful. Or you're like at your like first job or you're like in high school again and you're like, why am I here? And it doesn't even like look like it, but it is it at the same time. Those are definitely bizarre. Excuse me. Give me, give me. Flash? Oh, that's not gonna. Wait, is it gonna give me a flash grenade? reload because that is oh we're good <laughs> wait what did he say oh spock most of my dreams i'm in this forest running by kids trying to find out who kidnapped my young brother mm. it's okay to be a bit repeater because if you brought someone joy and someone wasn't there for it, you bring the same joy to the other person. Quake ran for the light. It was pointless. He would never reach it. His life would be snuffed out just as easily as the very thing he thought would save him. Oh, we're reaching that easy. Even with the light gone, all I could do was keep going. Oh, shut the fuck up. Nobody is behind me. We keep going. Let's not beat around the bush. You have a lot of problems, Alan. I do. I do. I'm I don't think so these paintings were here in the first one. I would have admired them. That was not in the original. Maybe we never got to go to this hallway. Since we're being so frank here, oh, Alan, whoa, I can choose. Reiterate how happy I am that you've had this breakthrough. 
I would like to summarize your condition. Wait, oh. By all means. Oh. And please, just let me know if you think I'm being unfair. Oh. All right. Well, let's start with the obvious. The car crash. Untreated head trauma. All due respect to Doc Nelson, but he's hardly a neurosurgeon. I think that the injury has affected you more than you realize. Hello, Taylor. Yeah, I, I have had bad headaches. Then there's your history of substance abuse, which, combined with your chronic insomnia, has resulted in hallucinations and extremely poor impulse control. That's a dangerous combination, one which your wife has unfortunately had to suffer from far more than you. I know. I know she has. I don't think I'm exaggerating when I say that you are existing in a state of all-encompassing denial. Your vivid fantasy casts you as a heroic victim and allows you to skirt responsibility for your own actions. It allows you to solve your imaginary problems and dismiss the things that truly trouble you. In your self-serving delusions, your personal problems are assets that allow you to save Alice, perhaps even the world. Dr. Harmon, I... I think that's spot on. I can't argue with any of that. Well, I'm sure I'm stating the obvious. I don't want to labor the point, but, well, um... No, no. I understand. It's important that I face it. Precisely, Alan. You've put so much effort and imagination into this self-deception, but what good has it really done for you? You refused my offer of help, and here you are. Did being so obdurate really get you to a better place? No. No. And did it really help Alice? Was this really the best thing for your wife? Probably not. Probably not. Why don't we find out? You know, I've been talking with her. There's something she wanted you to hear. Oh, hey. That sounds like fun. What the... All I ever wanted was to help you, Alan. I ate all the shit you handed out and tried to understand your pathetic, wealthy white male drama until my life consisted of managing your never-ending crisis. I hate you for your childish temper and the arrogance and self-indulgent pride that undermine all efforts to drag you out of the hole you insisted on digging for yourself. Damn. I hate you for leaving me in the dark with that insane monster bitch! All you had to do was act like a loving human being for once in your life and stay with me. Damn. If your dramatic exit hadn't been more important than making sure I was all right, she would never have taken me. I don't know where you went, but that's okay. I don't want to know. I don't think I'll ever be all right. The only thing that keeps me from killing myself is the hope that I'll never see you again. Ouch. Doesn't make I, any sense at all. I just can't argue with that. The hope of never seeing you again. I think I should stay here before I ruin it. Hey, tiny mouse, mouse red eye. You got your brushes and think this paints. Is a breakthrough, and you paint along with us and chill. I think you'll enjoy it. You. Oh. Yeah, this is DLC of uh, the first Alan Wake. So I have the Alan Wake remastered version, and it came with two little specials, which are kind of just DLCs to the game. It was nonsense. I knew I had saved her. I'd succeeded in that, and that yeah. was all that mattered. What I heard in there wasn't the truth. It was just another toxic mirage. It cut deep, but that made me all the more determined to force myself to snap out of it. I didn't want to be that guy anymore. I had to make myself see the light. Hi, Tiny. And at last I see the light. How do I fucking make that jump? Da -da 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 -da. Oh. Earthquake! You got it from Parks and Rec? I need to finish Parks and Rec. I started it way, way, way. Oh, motherfucker. Literally. <sighs> Fuck the developers of this Whoa, game. Specifically for that, just that. Everything else is okay, I, I, is questionable in some regards of character creation and... But fucking items spawning and just dropping off a cliff, like, immediately? That's broken! Why did you do that? I think I still have a billion of those. Well done. 
You have come far, but there's still a little further to go. You must take full control of your own mind. Reject all of the fantasies you have constructed. Yeah, well, I think I can do that. They're specifically the messing with us, making it all personal, fall off. Maybe it's brilliant well, writing. It but it's not fooling me. I know it's fake. Good. Because it's his dream and it's aware. a nightmare and it's a nightmare to play. Part of bent on self-destruction is not. Could but work. you must be careful just because you know the lies for what they are. That doesn't make the danger any less real. I'll make it. I don't have any choice. Here. I cannot come any further, but this will help you on your way. Thanks. I guess. What the fuck did he give me? <laughs> Nice focus. Whoop. Oh, is it more in lower? Alright, let's see if this memory is involving something spicy again. Hey, let me tell you something, Alan. I know how your mind works. You screw up, then you start analyzing it, and before you know it, you start writing all these horror stories in your head. Don't you? Come on, I don't do that. <laughs> Yes, you do. I know how it goes. You're a complete failure. I hate you and I'll never forgive you for whatever it was that you did. Am I wrong? Oh, man. See? I know you. But, Alan, it's all in your head. It is. I love you. And I'm not going anywhere. Hmm. Interesting. Sounds good, Tiny. Have a great uh, rest of your night. And thank you so much for hosting us. I hope you had a good stream again. Ignite. Oh, and then it's gonna hit the bridge. Oh, that's cool. That's pretty neat. Okay. They kept coming. There were too many of them. Hordes and hordes of them. Swarming over the landscape, eager to kill. They were coming for Wake. And this time they would get it with sheer numbers. What is clear? Oh, fun. Okay, well, let me do that so I can get that. Huge. Lovely. This is cool. Clearing rocks so that the lighthouse can get them. Very neat. Uh, Logan, I feel like we're decently far. I feel like we've made some ground. I know it's about a similar length as the first one. Excuse me. Let's not do that. All right, let's vibe check real quick because I don't want to have to go up this entire thing again. Oh, we reached a checkpoint. Fuck yeah. This is cool. I don't think we've died a whole lot in this DLC. In the last DLC, we died a, uh, a shit ton. Right. 
Yeah, la last one we were having uh, some troubles. I guess I could kite him over here. My batteries are out. I have some flares left. the light beautiful the lighthouse i was relieved to have made it here but i wasn't sure what was going to happen now yeah no kidding hard to predict anything in the stream what the fuck was that what the hell is that sound Zane had left me. I wasn't sure what the Dark Presence had done to him if he couldn't follow. But from now on, I was on my own. Still, he had gotten me this far. I would never have made it by myself. This thing was going to end. It wouldn't be long now. Return? That read return, didn't it? Rather than like climb? That must have been the lighthouse we were just at, but now we're at oh now we're at the island I was surprised again. By the change of scenery, but not mm. much. I was starting to understand the symbolism. The way the dark place flowed. Wow. It's gorgeous, Alan. It's something, alright. Hmm. This is the final stretch, we're blazing through it. Yeah, I think the no deaths is incredibly helpful I, f I do find this one more um uh, feeling kind of depressed here uh, what? so Zane's your new buddy now I feel abandoned this is ridiculous you're not even real <laughs> that doesn't mean I don't have any feelings very go get a cozy blanket Uh, I find this one more, I don't even know how to explain it, but it, it's Please, like more fun because there's just rational so here. many abandon cool your things you're jumping right? through, whereas the last one was just like spell. entirely I'm combat. Fine. You're abandoned. Fine. Oh, did he just ask us to abandon him? Goodbye, Barry. Al, what I'm saying is the only way you're getting in that cabin is through me. It's one of those kill your darlings things sure but barry hell, you're used fucking to that, put your fists up shot writer right. i'm down here barry i'm done with you anyway <clears throat> what does it say about you when you're this desperate to keep yourself from getting better wait here we go 
Armored! A 50% commission! Hi, Barry. It's great that you first make yourself an imaginary hey, friend. And then you I can't even get along with that guy. Evil skills, Al. You're a master. Let's crack that writer's block of yours, Alan. <laughs> and it's not just that. You're a fiction, an expert on murder and dark alleyways. And a master of substance abuse. That's the best part. This might actually be kind of tough because we're out of batteries. You'll make a great hunting trophy, my boy! Oh, I'm capped, I'm capped, I'm capped! Uh, my job mostly consists of making sure you don't lose your entire life, but we do have all the impulse control of a big boss fun. It's very enriching. I have several lawyers on speed dial just because I never know when you get in trouble again. You know what kind of people need that? Gangsters and assholes. Not again! Because they make money all the time! Hey! When you threw a hissy fit, because your wife tried to help you, he couldn't make it, and because of that, you almost got me killed a dozen times over. It's the rock stars! It's the guys, I forget their band name. That's so cool, I'm fighting everybody. Where's where's my infinite shotgun shells game? Oh my god, they're hitting us with a guitar! Oh my god, I didn't realize the first one was a guitar. I thought it was like a fucking sign of some sort, and now I'm realizing they're guitars. That's so cool. The old gods, yes. Shotgun shells. I'm oblivious. It's totally not fitting that you have to literally pay your best friend to hang out because everybody else refuses to put up with your surly ass. I can't believe the final boss is Barry. That's incredible. Blurry. Ow, I swear to God, you're driving me nuts. Birds are so annoying. I wish I had a flash. I think we got them. Just keeps 
expanding. All right, well, let's cap everything. Might as well. He got his shit rocked. Okay, cool. That wasn't too bad at all. survive in this place the way he had and I might not make it back a second time you don't have that fun suit he's got Leaving buddy this place would be hard maybe impossible it wouldn't take much for my thoughts to stray again it was too easy to get lost in the dark place before I was ready to curl up and die let myself slip away. But here I was. The yet unwritten future. Me. A sequel to Departure. My name is Alan Wake, and I'm a writer. You guys, he's a writer. We hit the true end of the game! 